tales are a traditional way of telling the stories of Aboriginal families and clans and of keeping records of important historical events. In this lesson, you will create a totem pole that tells a story of you as a PYP learner. Use the planning sheet to create the front or the front and the back of your design. In your planning stage, research the meaning of different animals and the symbolism behind each one. Animals in many cultures are used to symbolize different human characteristics and they're great to use in your planning. Don't forget that you can use different objects that also symbolize things, like a pencil shows creativity. Use the internet to help you search for different images. Your first step in creating the totem will be to create a base and a cylinder. I believe you could also create your totem with just the cylinder and no base. When creating my design, I do a variety of things with the clay. I cut away, for example, the eyes, or I add on like I have with the eagle's beak. Don't forget to always slip, score, and blend all of the pieces that you add on to your totem. The idea behind the learner totems was for my students to express their growth in learning throughout the PYP years. I wanted them to use symbolic meaning in order to express their abstract ideas in art. This final totem has a beaver which represents my sense of accomplishment. It has an eagle which symbolizes being a teacher and at the top it has an owl showing my growing wisdom as I age. On the back of the totem I included a violet representing my shy character, a butterfly that shows hope and represents hope in the future, and a chain representing coming together. In this totem, I did not use a base, I simply used the cylinder. And there's a variety of images on it without using animals. I've used a circle to show how a person becomes whole through their years of learning. I've used brush and palette to show creativity, and pencil represents one's imagination. I've also used a vine to show growth, and floating balloons that represent happiness. So feel free to use a variety of animals or different objects that are symbolic for different meanings that represent you as a learner through your years in the PYP program.